arrested in Tampa during protests supporting the Cuban people have just bonded out of jail. They're accused of several charges, including battery on a law enforcement officer. Our cameras were there as the men were released from the Hillsborough County Jail. And ABC Action News reporter Haley Bull was also there. Haley, you spoke to those men just after they walked out of jail, right? That's right. It was an emotional moment. One shouting free Cuba as he walked out of this jail to his friends and family. Take a look at this scene less than an hour ago. That's when Mikhail Vasquez was asked if he'd protest again. He said he'd do anything for Cuba. Michael was one of three protesters arrested during a demonstration on Tuesday. A judge sent bond for two of them today, Michael and Julian Rodriguez Rodriguez. Those two face multiple charges, including battery on a law enforcement officer. Take a listen to what Julian told us just moments ago. One of the guys, I don't know who it is, see, they almost killed me in the ground. And I told him, I don't know if they, they have the video. I tell him, I can breathe, I can breathe, and they stop, but oh, I almost like die in the, in the ground. So they not show that in the news, but I'm going to tell the truth here now. Now, this is the footage Tampa police released. According to court documents, police say Michael hit an officer trying to block the protesters' path to the interstate, hitting the officer's hand away, and that Rodriguez grabbed an officer from behind and hit him in the face. Julian denies that and says he was trying to stop police from tasing another protester, not hurt an officer. He says he was protesting for his young daughter still in Cuba. We also talked to Michael. A friend translated his words for us. Take a listen to that interview. What he do is not hit the police, the law enforcement uh, worker is just try to stop him to put too much pepper spray in the face or the body of somebody else. Now Michael tells us he'll do anything for his country and Julian tells us he still wants to see U.S. intervention in Cuba. We'll of course keep you updated as this case develops. Reporting live in Hillsborough County, Haley Bull, ABC Action News.